What's up guys, it's Steven from TechSteveHD.com, making technology easier. Now, I've been doing quite a few Fitbit videos and today I want to do a video on how to set up the ARIA scale. Now, if you can see over here, this particular scale is pretty cool because it uses your application to monitor your weight, your body mass, and things like that. It really helps you easily use the application to track your progress. So sit back, relax, and let me show you how to set it up. Let's get started. Fitbit Aria Scale, you can use up to eight users. It tracks your body weight, body mass, and body fat percentages. It's available in black and white and also needs 802.11b Wi-Fi connections. It has a nice glass surface. It has padded feet, as you can see right here. Also, it has this dimple design with really hard plastic, so it's built to last. To get to the battery is very easy. You just pull this little lid off the bottom and here you have four batteries ready to go. To put the scale in setup mode, you simply want to take the battery cover off, remove one of the batteries and count to 10. Then reinsert the battery, put the cover back on, then you want to press the corners really fast and then you'll see setup initialized. Okay, first thing you want to do to set it up is go to fitbit.com forward slash setup. As you can see here at the bottom, you have the ARIA Wi-Fi scale. So before you do this, you want to make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. As you can see at the top of my screen, if you're kept plugged in with an Ethernet cable, this process will not work. Now that's connected, I'm going to go to Get Started Here. And then from this screen, you can download Windows or you can download Mac. Let me go ahead and download the Mac software. Now with the software downloaded, go ahead and click on it to open it up. Now you want to click on Get Started. And if you don't have an account, go ahead and set up one now. But I have an account, so I'm going to go ahead and log in. Here, you're going to go ahead and set up your uh, profile, the name your scale, and also select you. You can add, again, eight different people. So let's go ahead and hit next. You may get a pop-up like this. It's just confirming that you're connecting it to the right network. If it is, hit yes. As you can see, it's now successfully set up. Now let's pull up the count to see if it's there. From your setup screen, you can see now it's on your list here. And you can see you can add more people here. You can add up to seven people. What you want to do is you can put their email address in there. And then once they get that confirmed, they can go over to your scale and set themselves up. You can also edit the data here. And as you uh, stand on it and get weights, you'll see all your measurements and stuff like this right here. You can put in your pounds all these different uh, kilograms. You can edit your name right there. Very, very simple, including the battery life. Now, if you want to remove this off your count, it's very simple. You just click on people, you click on the little negative button, and when you remove the last person, it automatically takes it off your account. That simple. So there's my video on how to set up a Fitbit Aria scale. So if you're thinking about getting one, they're about $129. That's up to you if you want to do it. But the cool thing about this particular scale is with the Fitbit watch, and the scale combo, you can actually really see how your progress is. Like all my videos before, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.